What's up guys, it's Jeff with I Download Blog. Let's talk about the Apple TV 5.2 beta. This beta brings Bluetooth keyboard support finally to the Apple TV. No more tedious inputting passwords and SSIDs with the remote control. I'm gonna show you how to set it up. Go to General, under Options, go to Bluetooth, and then you wanna just grab your Bluetooth keyboard. You see it here. And I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on. Okay, it's turned on. Hit the little sync button at the top. It looks like it's flashing blue. And you can see it's recognizing the keyboard. And once the keyboard is recognized, you can just go down and select it and it'll start the pairing process. Then you'll get a little code here to enter on your keyboard, 1954, 1954. Oh, and then you also need to hit the return key on your keyboard as well. Once you do that, the pairing request will complete. You'll see it says connect it there and we're good to go. We can actually start using our keyboard right now. I'm actually controlling this right now with the arrow keys on my keyboard. It's super easy to do. Now, of course, the great thing about this is you can go to your network setup and start entering your Wi-Fi SSID if you have it hidden and your password using the keyboard. No more tedious remote control input. It's so great to be able to just use your keyboard and quickly type in the SSID just like that. Super easy. Folks, this has been needed since the beginning. I don't know why Apple's just now adding Bluetooth keyboard support, but better late than never, I say. Now, as stated, the Bluetooth keyboard support only appears in the beta version of the Apple TV firmware thus far, so you'll have to wait unless you're a developer, but it should be out in the near future for the public version. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.